Hey everyone, uh, welcome to BS Explained. Uh, this video, uh, let's discuss how to set up a uh, BACnet device ID specifically on uh, Class 3200 uh, KWH Smart Meter. I uh, specifically wanted to do this uh, short video uh, since I went through the pain of uh, setting up uh, the BACnet instance IDs for these and uh, the documentation on the web doesn't really help neither the documentation which comes with the meter. So uh, hopefully the next time someone has to go through that uh, or else into this uh, video which I'm posting and uh, uh, helps them out. So let's get on with the video. Uh, hope this helps you guys. Thanks. So before setting up these meters, uh, you guys have to set up the baud rate for the meter so that it, it talks to you uh, in the same baud rate of what your controller is picking up. So. The panel is going to look like this with all the meters embedded into the panel like this and it will have these logs which you can um, lock in and lock uh, by pushing this thing in and then screwing tight. So the back of the panel is going to look like this. I would recommend uh, setting up these things uh, before these are live. Now as you can see here in the meter this is your live connection where uh, 277, 120, or 480, uh, three phase, single phase, or uh, anything can go in. And these are the CT connections which you see here, like phase A, B, C, all three phases will have their own uh, current transducers. And this is where you terminate your uh, backnet MSTP uh, plus and minus. And the baud rate is going to be, it is very tough to see, but the dip switches you see here, this is where you set up your baud rate and uh, making this up and down is gonna set up your baud rate to 9600 till uh, 115200 i'm gonna i'm gonna show you this is set up to 38400 which i use to communicate and above this this is where you see the tx and rx if the uh, meters are communicating with my controller snap so this you'll have to set this up before the panel is live and then move on to setting up the backnet instance for all these uh, meters which you see. So after setting up the MSTP, you have a, a display for class 3200 KWH smart meter. This is e 32 m back kit, BAC kit, paints backnet. If you want mod bus, this is going to come in a different part number so look out for this one now it has four dials this is menu this is select and this is up and down so the way you set up the backnet instance on this one is you go to menu here and then go down below to backnet settings here you can select the mstp mac of what you need for this current meter i need it for 23 and then max master will be uh, 127 you come back to the menu you go to device instance press select press select again until you go to backnet id and then keep going down until you go to zero and then the lowest uh, the last number is after zero so you press that and if you keep pressing or hold this, it's gonna go to individual uh, number. So in here, you're gonna go to the first digit here, make this to, oops, sorry. make this to zero and then come back. So I need 23 and I need my address to be 102223 so what i'm gonna do is keep selecting until i get to that number all right so i need this number so what i'm gonna do after this is press on the menu it says you want to save this and then select yes thanks for watching the video uh hope you liked it um so please keep coming back to uh, watch more videos like this uh, put in your suggestions in the comments so that i can make more helpful videos um, thank you again